months of planning and prepping, a windward Oahu highway is now lined with food trees for the first time. Hopefully it gives fruit one day and we can come back and uh, enjoy the fruits of our neighbor. Alfred Molina was among the dozens of volunteers planting ulu trees and mountain apple trees along Kahekili Highway Saturday morning. We got to be self-sufficient. We got to be able to plant our own crops and eat our own food and, uh, you know, be our own people again. Invasive halekoa trees and overgrown guinea grass were removed to make way for the food trees. State Senator Brenton Awa says the focus is paving the way towards sustainable agriculture. Yeah, we're going to feed people. But the goal with this is to be the seed. Awa says it was the Department of Transportation who gave the green light. They saw how much community was involved in this and they started helping, which was good. Um, but this project specifically with this area was just a quick ask to Ed Sniffen of the DOT. Ed. In a statement, State Transportation Director Ed Sniffen says his department is proud to support the grassroots community initiative that will not only beautify roads, but also provide a source of food for area residents. Awa says it'll be between three to five years before the trees begin to bear fruit. They've put out these totes that can hold up to 275 gallons of water to nourish the trees. The totes are covered with art created by the elementary students. I think it's very important to be here planting because we're putting our hands into work that will hopefully build the future. And hopefully this is a seed for more to come and more to spread throughout the islands. 70 trees are now taking root. The trees and equipment to make it all happen were donated 